What is up, Nerf Nation? I'm Naptown Nerf, and today we're going to be doing something a little different. We're going to be reviewing some pretty slick sunglasses and talking about iPro for Nerf. So some of you may be familiar with the company Flux. They have been very nice to the Nerf community, and I'm greatly appreciative for that. I think it's really cool that they are sponsoring Nerfers with their sunglasses. I just think that's awesome, and they were kind enough to send me a few different pairs for review for you guys to let you know how awesome these things are. We also will have a 10% discount code that I'll let you know about at the end of the video, so stay tuned for that. But these sunglasses are really, really nice. And for the price point they're at, they are top notch. And I'm very impressed by them. I am a big fan of Oakley's. If you guys know me at all, personally, I wear Oakley's all the time. Like, I wear lots of sunglasses. I own quite a few different pairs of sunglasses. And I pretty much wear two different pairs, which are actually the same type of Oakley. And really really like those a lot but they are super expensive and i actually haven't purchased a pair in quite some time had to replace the lenses in them several times as they tend to get scratched but that's gonna be the case for i think pretty much any pair of sunglasses but these sunglasses are of equal quality in my opinion and very very nice these are the avento sunglasses they are very bold with these blue frames and they do have polarized lenses. All of the sunglasses that I'm showing you today actually have polarized lenses, so that's really, really nice. I have gone to polarized lenses in my Oakleys, and honestly, I probably will not go back because they just make everything so clear, and they actually make important things that you're looking at brighter, but obviously shade you from the sun. So it's kind of hard to explain exactly how they look without trying a pair on for yourself, but they are pretty darn cool if I do say so myself. So these are polarized lenses and you know, they look really good. I really like the design and look of this specific pair quite a bit. They, uh, they look like they don't have a full frame around the lens on the front side, but on the back, they do, so I actually like that look quite a bit, and the feel of them is very nice. They sit really close to my face and are very, very comfortable. So these have nice rubber tips on the noses here for comfort, and then also have a rubber part on the side here that go around your ear or over, over your ear, I guess. These are very high-quality sunglasses. I'm very surprised that you know, you can get a pair of sunglasses like these for around $23 is what I believe they sell them for on Amazon. And along with that, you get a bag and a cleaning cloth. So that's really cool. And I believe that pair also comes with these cases. At least my pair did. I'm pretty sure they said that that pair specifically came with a case. So I'm assuming they do. The other pairs do not come with a case, which... I think would be a nice touch to sell all the sunglasses with cases, but I know that obviously adds cost. Let me show you the other pairs of sunglasses we're gonna be looking at real quick here. This is my probably next favorite pair, and these are the Rainier sunglasses, and these actually have a little higher quality polarized lens, and you really do notice the difference when you're comparing the two, but I honestly think both sunglasses are very nice. Uh, these are a little more expensive, but you know, you get a nicer quality lens with that. These are actually supposed to be shatterproof, and so they're a lot more durable of a lens. They're just like a much stronger quality. I believe they're polycarbonate lenses, and yeah, they're pretty nice. But honestly, I think all these will do just fine when it comes to Nerf play. Nerf darts are not going to be a problem. You're not going to shatter any lenses with Nerf darts unless you're getting hit point blank with like a very high powered blaster. I even don't think then that you'd have an issue, but you know, these are definitely a little higher quality lens and maybe worth the 
extra cost depending on your needs and, and wants in terms of a pair of sunglasses. But I do like these a lot. They are very comfortable. They are a little wider around the head. They feel like they're slightly bigger than the previous pair, uh, but they are both very comfortable. It just depends on how you like your sunglasses to fit and obviously look, the style of them are quite a bit different, but both very nice sports sunglasses. So the last pair is called the Sport Tech, and these come in quite a few different colors as well, and they all come with different frame colors and lens colors. So definitely check out their Amazon links in the description box below to see all the different varieties you can get. But these are pretty sweet. These are a more simple pair of sunglass. Very nice though with the red lenses. I think those are really, really cool. Jill has picked these out to keep for herself actually because she really likes these. And they're kind of similar to the blue ones in the way they look a little bit with the, you know, cut out in the frame there on the bottom. But again, on the back, they are full. So I think comfort wise, that's really nice. And then they also have the rubber noses and rubber on the sides. These actually have rubber on both sides. So, I mean, I'm not sure why you need them on the outsides, but it's kind of a cool look. But yeah, very, very comfortable. These feel really, really light. They are very lightweight. So if you like a really lightweight sunglasses, these are definitely the lightest weight, but none of them are heavy by any means. They're all plastic sunglasses. So I always prefer a lighter weight sunglass. Like I've never really liked metal frames just because it's very heavy on your head and obviously not great for Nerf to wear things that are super heavy and things that could also fly off. These hold on to your head very nicely along with the other two pairs. They also sent me a plain black on black here. So if you like a more simple lens color, this may be the way to go. But like I said, the other varieties come in, you know, black on black. I think they all come in that and uh, in, in more normal colors if you don't want like the bright blue uh, frames or something like that. So pretty cool, very lightweight, very nice. I'm gonna go back to the Rainier here for a second because these are very, very cool. They, you can really tell the difference between the polarized lenses with these compared to the other ones. They are definitely a notch above with the polycarbonate lenses. Really like those a lot. One thing I will note, they have a picture of these on Amazon and the blue lenses don't look like this, but this is what they'll look like. Hopefully they show up well on camera. They are much more blue, darker blue than they are in that picture. I think that picture is a little misleading and honestly, they look much better in person than they do in that photo in my opinion. But these are the matte gray frames, but I mean, I guess they're a matte color, but you know, they're very, very nice. I really like the gray look. I really like the rubberized back tips here. These are a complete rubberized part of the sunglass frames there so that's really really nice and they also have a different but very nice rubberized nose piece also and that's really really cool these actually unscrew so you could replace that i believe i'm not sure if you could buy a replacement for them and that's the other thing is i don't think you can replace the lenses themselves in these sunglasses like you could like a pair of oakley's and like at least a lot of the pairs of oakley's but at the price point you're buying these at like these are, I believe, around $45, the other around $23. You're gonna be able to afford to buy a new pair of sunglasses altogether. You won't need to worry about just replacing lenses. So, I mean, most of the time you'll buy a pair of polarized lenses for $50. So the whole pair of sunglasses is less than that. So that's pretty darn cool, if I do say so myself. And one thing that I really wanna stress in this video is eye protection is super important when playing Nerf. I don't care if you're playing around the house, you're playing anytime you're firing Nerf darts or rival rounds or any sort of projectile at someone else, even if you're not trying to aim for the head, you could possibly get hit in the eye. So no matter where you're playing or how you're playing, please wear eye pro. If you're out in the sun with, you know, on a very bright day, Sunglasses may be a great option, obviously. It will also allow you to see your opponent better and not be blinded by the sun. You know, lots of reasons to obviously wear sunglasses, but if you're indoors or if you're in a darker setting, obviously just a simple pair of safety glasses is very, very nice. And honestly, I mainly nerf with 
clear lenses like this because our field outdoors is very shaded so there isn't a lot of sunlight and usually sunglasses are a bit too dark so i usually wear something as simple as this i'll put a link in the description also to where you can pick some of these up they come in like a pack of 12 and they're like a buck each like they're very very cheap and you know i highly recommend you know picking up several and you know loaning them out to your friends also highly recommend wearing ipro in pvp tournaments and hvz very important for zombies to wear ipro zombies wear ipro it's very important sunglasses your regular prescription glasses or safety glasses they're all good options you know wear something it's just something that i feel like is one of the most important safety things in our hobby is to wear good eye protection and i just really wanted to stress that in this video because i really don't ever talk about those things in my videos so hopefully you guys enjoyed this short review of some pretty cool sunglasses i really do like them a lot they are very very nice thank you so much flux for sending them my way and promoting the nerf community i think that's really really cool i was uh, able to actually play against paradox in the foam pro tour and they were sponsored by flux and they all looked really good in their sunglasses very intimidating a little bit intimidating i'll be honest i think we were sort of intimidating i don't know if we were intimidating in our space gear but it's okay we had a lot of fun i know that much we had tons of fun and i cannot wait for the foam pro tour next year all right so what you guys all want to know if you want 10 percent off use the code flx nerf 10 off that is flx nerf 10 off all one word so thank you guys so much for watching i really really like the flux sunglasses they are super comfortable and they will probably go into that rotation with my Oakleys. I've actually been wearing them pretty much all the time and not been wearing my Oakleys nearly as much. I still like my Oakleys. I'll still probably still wear my Oakleys. Obviously, I spent a lot of money on them and, and I, I just like them a lot. But the Flux sunglasses are equal quality and obviously so much cheaper. So if you're buying sunglasses for the first time or if you one of those people that lose your sunglasses a lot or break your sunglasses a lot, Flux sunglasses are definitely the way to go. They are just not so much of an investment, but thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this review of the Flux sunglasses and this little educational video about Nerf eye protection. Smash that like button. Please subscribe. Ring the bell for notifications. And as always, peace out.